welcome to Malaysia. Okay, today today I would like to talk about overview durian in Malaysia. I'm Muhammad Ali Hanafia bin Mazlan, and I'm working. Uh, I'm from DOA Department of Agriculture Malaysia, and based in Rau, the center of durian city in Malaysia. So let's talk about durian. Uh, durian is our Tony fruit as known as durian. Durian is our super fruit and king of fruit of Malaysia, same Thailand and Indonesia. We have about 23 species durio, and for durio zybertinus, we registered 226 varieties since 1934 under uh, Department of Agriculture Malaysia registration. This is our statistic data 2021, mentioned planted around 85,000 hectare and 68% of this is uh, 68% of the total area is productive area. With average uh, productivity yield around 7 to 8 metric ton per hectare. And harvesting season in June, July, August, October, and November. According to the data, we produce more 448,000 metric ton, metric ton around, and it's worth around 1.83 billion US dollar. And we export around 24,000 metric ton. And it's worth around uh, 20, 26 million USD. For 2021, one Malaysian eat 12.2 kilo durian. We are proud to be called a durian ghost. And this is a data of cultivated area in Malaysia. We can see the main area is Johor, Pahang and followed by another state. This is among the the top commercial variety in Malaysia, first D160 or Teka or Musang Queen, and D168 IOI. And our most popular, none other than the king himself, D167 Musang King, and also now as Maung Sangwang. And orange color of flesh is D200 or Black Thorn and now as Ochi or Hachi. For information, Musang King uh, registered in GIS, Ge Geographical Indication of Malaysia. The registration is about origin and Malaysia is suitable for planting durian. And this is uh, another species in Malaysia, Durio graviolens. This native species is easily found in Sabah and Sarawak, Borneo. It has four color variation, yellow, orange, pink, and red. Malaysian durian are harvested, ripened, and naturally falls from tree. We use, we using, we are using net and string to prevent our durian from falling to the ground. This method to ensure the fruit are not damaged and minimize the risk of pathogen infection to the fruit. For export to China, this method is compulsory for China export protocol. In addition, the method of tying fruit by using string is one of farmer practice. The, advan the, the advantage is that we can have an accurate calculation for your record based on number of string. How Malaysians eat and enjoy durian? The tradition stuck way ago during along the history of our ancestors. Malaysian durian naturally ripen on trees for get maximum satisfaction in taste and quality. What is relative the tradition and scientific? When is the best time to eat durian? We can enjoy it 12 to 24 hours after durian fall to make sure the durian complete the ripening cycle to get sweet, bitter, creamy, sticky, and fragrant taste. To get all of this type to enhance taste, it become from a carboxylic acid formation due to carbohydrate metabolism, 
changing to glucose and fructose. And this uh, 2017 promotion, durian promotion at Nanning, China and attract around 165,000 visitor to try it on three days. And this is example of durian tasting experience. We can enjoy four to five varieties in one plate. And this, uh, and this is durian education. We can enjoy and learn. And this is global market route by country and type of product. Nation has received the approval of 20 facilities for frozen whole food, 41 facilities for pub paste processing by GACC China. And this is condition of fruit that has been frozen through cyrogenic cryogenic freezing at temperature minus 80 to minus minus 100 110 degrees and this uh to ramp up ioi ochi musang king and musang queen and this is a uh, durian paste b24 and ioi And this is agronomy practice planting technology. Generally, for Musang King and, and another variety, we plant with we plant with thirty five feet uh, distance. But for Black Tongue, we plant thirty feet between three. Common problem for planting is tree tend to yellowish and plant die after established. The main factor of this problem is water lock. Durian need more water with proper drainage. We can see the picture and the success rate about 40 to 50 percent only, and we found many landslides happen. This is indicator and sign of weak drainage. The success rate for planting durian is subjective, depend on farm management, but with this technology, we can improve uniformity and success rate. Okay. The technology is a soil mount system. We plant durian on mount and this technique designed to control the water table mount technique the size for this method is four to five feet high and 12 to 15 feet width many things is to hide from from our observation after three to four years planting in mount with the with three feet high is going flat and it's not working and this is example for for mine and 80 months tree with soil mount. As we know, water management is the main focus on durian management, and it is our new observation and research to make sure we can overcome water factor. We plan on greenhouse, and for our target is bear the fruits in off season. As we know, durian need drought to induce flowering within shelter we can control other factors, especially rain and mount system is technique to control water. Hopefully we can produce a uh, fruit all the year. Water management. Water is life according to uh, DOA paper with rate ETO 4.9 millimeter per day. The rate water requirement for early stage from planting is 37 liter per day. Increase to 127 liter per day for vegetative is about one year after planting. And for mature tree, the water requirement is 327 liter per day. For immature, water method is three to four days per round and depend on current weather. We recommend to use mist spray or mini sprinkler to focus on canopy zone only. For mature, the technique watering is the same three to four days per round, but, but it depends to the three stages. And this is a uh, three stages. Okay, this is technique and time to control watering by stages for flushing stage, F1 to F2. <clears throat> we apply 100% uh, water and stop until 70% of the mature for induced flower bite. 
and for emphasis, we control it again to make sure the tree is still in reproductive stage and the rate going increased by stage going up to maximum till 90 days. We control it again on 90 days to lower the water content. This is a common challenge for our farmer. Normally when blooming stage, stage rains come. If the rains fall too heavy, the stages of tree will change. From reproductive stage to vegetative pack. As we know, nitrogen in rain content is high. Tree will produce new shoots again and flower will fall. Okay, we can see on the screen, the flower and epicalyx. Epicalyx starts to a uh, new leaf eh? and when the rain is too heavy we can see the chicken feet and farmer will die and what is the solution this is one of our observation beside the lot before we counter back with application high potassium foliar the potassium function is to boost acceleration of the leaf maturity and why we control the water at 90 days after emphasis? First, to get decrease the water content in fruit. As example, fresh date and dry date. Which one is sweeter? For watermelon, what is the best time to enjoy it? And for durian, wrinkle flesh means water content in flesh is controlled and low. We can get more satisfaction in taste. And this is a 160 or Mosang Queen with wrinkle flesh and it's so creamy and sticky. And to make sure water content is controlled, we can peel up the area like flower without break the flesh. We can open it like flower. This is a aerotic burn and it caused by lack of water and potassium. Look at the right picture. We can see two stages, fruits and flower. As we know, for three induced new flower bud, it requires long dry weather, 10 to 14, 14 days. So the fruit will get the aerotic burn cause lack of water <clears throat> when rapid grow. Solution is make the water source irrigation at it's best and maintaining the cover crop to control humidity. And for nutrient management from our observation and farmer practice, we can control thickness of husk for shelf life. With the right application, we can produce rhombic shape with application nitrogen and potassium with ratio 1 to and calcium application. The husk will only crack after three days fall. For above and notch, we do application with the ratio one, two and rotate with one, three, nitrogen and potassium rate and calcium also. We can get now, we can get to know a little bit about fertilizer management through the condition of the fruit like this, but it still require long observation. And this is a common problem. This is impact when our trees lack of calcium. The main problem of Musang King that is break easily if not control the husk thickness. The variation of seed come from our fertilizing program. This is full development seeds come from two factor. First, unhealthy tree impact to phytotrai attack. Trees produce large seed for survival for future generation before die. Second, the high phosphorus content. And for deflated seed, come when we control application phosphorus in 30 days after emphasis. From our observation, durian needs high P and K to induce flower bud. And after 30 days blooming, we need to stop or minimize phosphorus because at this stage, 
the seeds start develop. And this is a picture of deflated seed. And this is observation of nutrient application in hybrid seed. Empty. Basically, for durian, we only need one main stem per tree, one driver on one car, and for healthy tree, we keep eight to 12 horizontal branch because flower and fruit production is mostly concentrated on horizontal branches for musangking and variety in Malaysia. We need to cut small angle and overlapping uh, branches and for for our new observation, we start to set branching zone from 1.5 meter from the ground to 4 meter only. Okay, these are two main, uh, main stem and small angle branches. We call it as V and Y branches. And this is our observation. For PND management, this is a main disease on durian, durian, Phytoptera, Palmivora. The factor is not in the water and poor drainage system. How to treat this disease? Scratch the canker area and spray with metalaxyl or phosphoric acid or phosphate aluminium and drenching zone with metalaxyl or phosphoric acid and phosphate aluminium. Besides that, this is effect of nutrient management and heavy fruiting. For fruiting stages, we need to prevent it with dimotomop since flower bud stage. Impact of frequent percentage high rainfall will increase spread and fungal infection like Rhizotonia solani and Phytoptera. We need to make sure the ventilation on the tree is smooth and good drainage as prevention. And this is a Mudaria maniplaga, durian six borer, and conogitis, durian borer. Solution for this is uh, spraying from the early stage of flower or bud with systemic and translamina insecticide. Uh, lambda cellotrine and chlorofluorazuron since flower bud stage. On 2022, durian salilate or Allocaridecara malensis and scale insect has uh, become a serious threat for farmers. Serious infestation can cause tree death if not controlled. Solution for durian salilate is buprofazine and rotate with lemon extract and for scale insect, the solution is imidacloprid. <clears throat> okay, this is our observation. Durian silid treatment, it takes four months to recover with application buprozine and lemon extract. Lemon extract is for to break the shell of uh, eggs. This is Inform, uh, transformation durian in mature crafting. We change all three to commercial and selective, selected variety. According record, the tree will bear fruits 38 months after grafting. We call it as a durian express because it's manipulating the existing root system for all three. And this is a DOA program for rehabilitation technology. The observation for model to abandoned farm, we start with basic water system, vegetative program, and PNT control. First, for the first year, we focus on vegetative, and second year, we start to focus on reproductive stage. And every investment has challenge such as disaster. Every challenge require preparation and advanced planning as preventive measure. Drought, flood, lightning by stride, and heavy wind. <clears throat> this is a durian-based product. We can divide into two tradition and commercial product. Fried durian, steamboat durian, and official Malaysian dish. 
patin tempoyak, catfish uh, cooked with fermented durian paste. It has the creamy <coughs> and sweet of durian and melting fatty flesh of the fish. Must try if come to Malaysia. <coughs> durian can be attraction especially for tourists who directly contribute the national income. This is uh, Mrs. International Global. Try durian, durian map or durian root, durian monument and influencer. One of the unique attraction is enjoying durian nectar during emphasis. It also can attract at the attention of durian lovers. For information, durian flower will produce nectar during emphasis. This is a Malaysian sakura. <clears throat> when blooming time, we find there are bats present to suck nectar and directly become as pollination agent. This is a this is proof that durian can produce a good ecosystem, ecosystem chain and good agriculture practice. GAP is a guide to ensure sustainability in agriculture industry. It has become a standard that every farmer must follow. And hope durian industry can develop towards smart farming management, R&D support, technical cooperation with another country to ensure the sustainability and durian is forestry and it can also balance the ecosystem for our country if managed well. Thank you very much for your attention and time once again. Thank you very much.